In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you one of my favorite passing concepts in Madden 21 and how you can use it to literally beat every defense in the game. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is all about helping people become the best Madden player that they could possibly become through doing daily tips and tricks just like this one. So if you're looking to get better at this game, I just want to encourage you right now to hit the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. It is completely free to subscribe and you can always unsubscribe if you don't enjoy the videos. But every single day on YouTube, we break down offensive and defensive tips that can help you get better at this game. All right guys, so in today's video, what we're gonna be doing is we are gonna be taking a hard look at a concept um, or a route combination from the play inside switch. This is a very nice little flooding concept that you're gonna, I think, have a lot of, uh, you're just gonna get a lot of use out of this. So inside switch. And then defensively, what we're going to do here is we are just going to use kind of some standard zone drops, 5, 25, and 5, and kind of break down this, you know, as it pertains to different things. The beauty of the bunch tight end is you can use motion to create very, very interesting little route concepts and combos for the defense to have to worry about. So one of those combinations is coming to us from the inside switch. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the circle receiver on a hitch. I'm gonna smart route the X receiver and I'm gonna put the triangle receiver on a flat route. Now, if you want to learn my entire way to run the gun bunch tight end offensive guide, uh, I'm gonna leave a link to that in the description of this video. It's just 15 bucks and it literally walks you step by step through the entire offense. The bunch tight end for my money is probably one of the most simple offenses that you can run um, and, and simple still being very, very effective. So anyway, this is the route combination and all we're gonna do is we're gonna motion the circle receiver a couple of steps to the left, just like this right here, and then we're just going to snap the ball. Now the first read is always going to be this R1 running back. The R1 receiver is really, really glitchy. It's a really glitchy um, animation that he's gonna be able to get for you. So again, we're gonna smart route the X and the square receivers. We're going to put the triangle receiver on a flat and we're gonna put that circle receiver on a hitch. Now let's say that they may go man to man coverage on us. Same kind of thing. As long as you can hit this quick, that running back route can just get you some positive yards. It's, it's not, you know what I mean? It's not gonna get you, you know, 100 yards every time, but it is going to give you an opportunity. Now there's another window that which you can hit this. That's right there when he cuts the outside. Now if he has a good corner like Jair Alexander on him, then that's not obviously gonna be the best way to go about things but he can still get open, he can still make the catch. You don't throw a whole lot of picks on this unless they're user users. Now, if they run man coverage, your primary read's gonna be that square receiver. As you see, when he cuts to the middle of the field, he is pretty much always going to be able to beat the man-to-man -man coverage. Now, the beauty of this play is because of that corner mark to the tight end, you're going to have a lot of opportunity um, with that against man as well. As you can see right there, if he gets over the top, as long as he get, catches the ball, um, he is gonna be able to beat me in my coverage. So you just have so many options uh, within one play, and that's what makes this bunch tight end so, so special. Now, against zone coverage, what you're gonna notice is that this motion hitch, the reason you motion it is because you can get it into a very tender, um, you can get it into a very tender area of the field. Let me show you that one more time. So again, I'm just gonna motion snap it kind of right in here. And you're gonna notice that this is just a very tender area. The yellow zone doesn't quite cover it. The hard flat doesn't cover it because you have a flat zone that's gonna pull it. And so you now have really put the defense in kind of a pickle and they're just not able to, they're just not able to be able to hang with what you're trying to do offensively with this. Because with this motion right here, a lot of the yellow zones, you'll see this right in this example again, you see how they shift to the inside and now I've got an easy read. That's a five yard hook zone. That's about as good as you can get from a hook zone perspective to be able to stop this and we are still able to just laser and dot. It is such a simple offense, like I said, but it is such a powerful offense. It's so hard to stop this offense. And in my opinion, this might be one of my, this is probably one of my favorite offenses that I've created all year. And so if you have not got the bunch tight end offensive guide, I'm gonna encourage you to do that. I'm gonna leave a link to it in the description of this video. It literally walks you through step by step some of the most powerful passing concepts that I've ever created. And um, it's just a complete guide, guys. I really, really do enjoy this offense. I think this offense is super underrated still. Even though a lot of people are running some version of the bunch tight end, not very many people are running the bunch tight end for everything other than it has PA boot over. So this is going to teach you how to use PA boot over, but it's also going to teach you how to use 
everything else that the bunch tight end has to offer, which I believe is right there with the best of the best offensive schemes this year. So thank you for watching this video. And if you want to get that bunch tight end ebook, I'm going to be putting a link to that in the description. You can get that for just $15. If you have any questions, just feel free to text me. My number is 208-218-6900. And again, I'm going to leave a link to that ebook in the description for you.